this is the month of July 2015, and you're watching ZTV News. Now your host, the only woman banned in Arkansas, she knows what she did, Zonton! Greetings, my little zonelings, and welcome to a much belated ZTV News. Our apologies once again for the extended break, but all that matters now is giving you all the hard throbbing news you require. Okay, we must have been gone for way too long if that's the best double entendre you got. Shit. You're right. <gasps> oh, what was that? I couldn't hear you. Say that again. Into the microphone. You're right, Dave. Mm, one more time, you old bag. One more time. I said you right, fuck stick! Fuck me! You blew out my goddamn eardrums, you shit-sucking thundercat! Oh, goody. Maybe you'll take the day off and leave. What? I said, maybe you'll- What? Okay, let me take Dave into the green room until he calms down, will you, sweetie? I swear to God, when you least expect it, I'm gonna fit you for a barbed wire G-string, Zotan! Don't think this is over, you bubble-headed dick slave! I'm coming for you! And hell's coming with me! I'm sure it is, Dave. But first, let's open the mailbag. Our first letter comes from... Fuck you, Zone Sama. Who writes, You fucking idiot! Do you realize you have pulverized what little chance that the publishers and producers had to bring this show to Nickelodeon's channel? I am shocked to know that you ruined the creator of this show's life. And he said that he was writing on this show to make ends meet. Look what you've done, and do you realize that little kids that watched the pilot of this show and liked it when it came out, such as myself, I was nine, had their hearts broken when they found out this show will not be played on Nick, and those little pieces burned to ash as they saw your little porn video. It is not cool. Why? And to think I had thought that this was the best show ever. Thanks for ruining my childhood. Fuck you, Zone Sama. Well, fuck you, Zone Sama. I've only got a few things to say. One, you're welcome. Two, while it is said that the modifiers was never picked up for a full-length show, the reason it wasn't was not because of us. I mean, come on. If Rule 34 dictated the fate of television shows, then My Little Pony would have been cancelled a long time ago. And lastly, we didn't ruin your childhood. Your childhood was ruined on the day you were born. Wink. Our next letter comes from Holly, who writes, Hero, I just wanted to say your parodies are of top quality. You're really able to adapt to the art style of what you're parodying to make it look similar or even a bit real. I saw a subliminal clip of the Modic Cookers parody in a YouTuber's review of the Modifiers. I thought it was real. Yeah, yeah, I'm a dumbass. Anyway, my question is for Zone Um itself. I'm pretty sure Zone Tan is too busy fucking Lemmy or making Dave look more pathetic that he already is. Have you ever considered doing a collaboration with Shadman or anyone else who can ruin our childhoods? If you were to team up with someone, you would break the internet itself. Please respond whenever possible which will be in 18 years because of the schedule. Keep making my waifus fuck. Holly, ditch the fucking pathetic email I have. Hmm. Thank you for writing, Holly. Before I answer your question, I should say that I'm never too busy with Lemmy to answer questions from my lovely little zonelings. And that I can't make Dave out to be more pathetic than he already is. I know you're talking about me, cock <laughs> Yes, I am, Dave. Yes, I am. But to answer your question, Holly, we here at the Archive are big fans of Shadman's work as he draws super good art. 
super good art on his sin teach. He's even drawn me a few times, and I love every one of them. However, there aren't any collaborations planned at the moment, but if the opportunity presents itself, I'm sure he and Zone will indeed break the internet. Our last letter comes from Christina, who writes, Hey, Zontan, first of all, I gotta say I'm a big fan of your work, even as a girl. Not sure if you have girl fans? I am a lesbian, so my question is if it would be possible to have some panty and stocking on the archive. I discovered Zone not long ago, so I'm not very familiar with all the stuff you've got on your archive yet. But at least now I've asked you. I hope you can answer this on ZTV News. That would be amazing. Sorry for my horrible English. You see, I am from Norway. Your fan, Christina. Thank you for writing, Christina. Well, we do have a flash loop of panty and stocking already on the archive, I'm afraid you might not find it within your tastes. Also, I should add that while our fans are typically male, we do have quite a few female fans, so don't feel so alone, Christina. No matter who you are or what your walk of life is, everyone can enjoy seeing a cute animated chick getting plowed with angry tentacles. So schlick to your heart's content! <sighs> Oh, right. He's not here. Well, I suppose that leaves it up to me, then. Time for us to enter the gallery. This bit of cheesecake features yours truly, savoring a bit of ice cream in the shape of your childhood. Mmm, looks delicious. Big thanks to Studio Cute Pet for this lovely drawing of me. This piece is called Filiaton by the talented Frank Araya. I'm not sure why Philia is so modest. It's not like we haven't seen her in a more compromised position before. <laughs> Still, wonderful work, Frank. Ah, it looks like some of the girls who've been featured on the archive are a little peeved at me. Don't worry, girls, you are all equally sexy. Especially you, Raven. Thank you to Dipod for drawing this fun little piece. Now this, this is a pinup worthy of framing. The incomparable Tara Kanovich has truly outdone himself with this playful pinup of me. And for those of you wondering, I don't normally go commando. Normally. I have to say, I wasn't expecting a crossover with some of the Zaibatsu boys, but artist Gecko Ninja has surprised me with his piece, Zontan, Queen of the Zaibatsu. Hmm. Having dominion over two strapping young hunks? Yes, I like that quite a bit. And finally... <laughs> okay! Well, this is... Flattering. Thanks for making me a part of your body. Let me double check to see if the doors are locked. Well, uh, thank you for all your flattering fan art. And if you want to see your art on the show, be sure to send them to zone at zonearchive.com. We can't show the more risque art on the broadcast, but filth is appreciated all the same. But now, we have a special guest with us on the show, and it's none other than one of the Zaibatsu. Yes, the men behind the popular Let's Play channel, Two Best Friends. Please give a warm welcome to White Thunder himself, Matt. Hey, Zone 10, glad to be here. Well, we're glad to have you. We're big fans of Two Best Friends play here at the Archive. It's just a shame we couldn't get the rest of the Zaibatsu on the show. Uh, yeah, real, real shame that. Uh, so what's up with you? Wait, Matt, did you forward our email to the rest of the guys? Um, uh, yes. I knew it! Oh, no. Matt, you son of a bitch! Look, Pat, look, I know you're angry, man. Hear me out, though. I was... Mm, mm, yeah, no, there's nothing there, sorry. You know how bad this looks? 
were being associated with a girl that keeps a tentacle monster on a leash. Yeah, I know. Isn't it cool? No! No, it isn't! I'm right here. You know. Look, I, I don't see the big deal here. We've, we've played plenty of creepy anime bullshit games before. You played plenty of creepy anime bullshit games. Hey, what did you guys just say creepy anime? Stay, Stay out, out of this, this, Liam! And who let you out of those vents? Stay out of what, guys? Wait, wait, oh my god, Zontan's here! Did you guys know Zontan was here? Oh, hi, Liam. Yeah, um... Hi, Zontan. Uh, I I want to say I'm a, I'm a huge fan. I love all your I love all your works. I love uh your art. Uh, that that Wakfu one was amazing. I love you. Uh, I I don't no not like that. Sorry. No, I I I love the things you. I mm, I love you. Please just kill me, now. G guys. C come on, ba bail me out of this, guys. Are you kidding me, man? This is great. I. I just need some popcorn to make it complete. And bail you out how, Liam? I don't know, flash powder or uh, smoke bombs? Just, just something. What do you think, we're Batman? Batmans? Oh, dude, that, that'd be so sick. We'd be punching Joker in the face, be freaking billionaire geniuses, and an awesome three ways with Selena Kyle and Vicky Vale and Dick Grace. I, I just mean Vicky Vale and Selena Kyle. Just forget that. Matt, no! No, it, it can happen, DC. Just... Retcon, Catwoman is by, so boom! Instant three-way! Actually, that would make for a good scene. Wait a minute. Let's all just calm down and continue this interview as planned. We don't want any more interruptions. Mm, yo! Hey, none of you told me you were chilling with Zontan! We weren't! And what the hell, man? That was my last pie! I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, but seriously, Zone, I like your stuff. I got a few suggestions, all right? Hear me out. I want Kellen from Code Gaius, Videl, Sailor Uranus, Rukia, Furiosa, Soy Funk. Wait, I like short haired chicks, but why do you always have to go for them first? I do not. You just listed like 10 girls with short hair, Willie. Whatever. Look, all I'm saying is Zontan has been watching us fap this entire time. I think it's time we get to watch her fap. Wait, what? Willie, girls, Willie, girls can't fap. Can, can, can they? No, no, when when girls do it, it's called schlicking. Fine, then I think it's time that we get to watch her schlick. Hell yeah! Schlick! 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 Are they exactly? Well, when Zone makes a flash, there are tons of material that are left on the cutting room floor. Rather than letting them go to waste, Zone has collected the best of these bits and animated them for your enjoyment. Be on the lookout for future episodes of Out of Context. But the biggest news is reserved for last, as 2015 marks the 10th anniversary of Zone creating Flash cartoons for the internet. And to mark this momentous occasion, we're going back to the original. Yes, the first Flash Zone ever produced was of Kylie from Extreme Ghostbusters, and now, 10 years later, Zone is producing a full adult parody of Kylie in all her goth girl glory. Expect to see her in the archive very soon. That was the month that was here on ZTV. See you next time, and as always, I'm watching you fab. Please subscribe to the show and follow us on Twitter using the links below. If you got questions, email Zonetown at Zonetown at ZoneArchive.com. We also got shirts at Shark Robot. Buy them. Are you alright, Dave? What? <laughs>